All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is it, Shalom, to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Um, I want to go in this uh, topic, you know, basically, you say not want to do uh, this thing on your own. You know, you say not want to, to do pretty, when it comes down to this truth, you say not want to be on your own, man. You know, you should want to be with brothers, you know, and not just do your own thing. Because you got a lot of guys that, you know, uh, <clears throat> don't want to come in up under the order, man. You know, of, of uh, how about some y'all side, how the Lord set things up, you know. Um, when you, when you come into this truth, man, you know, if you want to, if you want to, like, let's say you want to, Join a uh, great millstone, you know. You should try to get with the camp, whatever city that you're in, or, or area, what state that you're in. You should try to get in contact with the local guys that are around you, okay? Check and see if there are brothers in your city that are doing the work, okay? That's just the simple. As it is, you got some guys that want to do their own thing, you know, you got uh, a, a camp already set up and, and guys just want to come in and, uh, you know, claim to be a part of Great Millstone, which you don't have to be uh, in Great Millstone to, to be of the elect, you know, the the truth of the matter is that Great Millstone Y'all by some y'all shot ultimately deals with order, man. You know, in the name Great Millstone, you know, it's just a, 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 a moniker, I guess, you know, if that's the right word. But it's, you know, it's a name that was given on to us, you know what I'm saying, through the spirit. But you got guys out here that, uh, you know, are pushing uh, this Great Millstone vibration, but they're not doing it under the order, you know, how they should be. Now, I'm going to start off with Acts uh, 6, 19 and 6. It says, And when Paul had laid his hands upon them, the Holy Ghost came on them, and they spake with tongues and prophesied. And all the men were about twelve. And he went into the synagogue and spake boldly for the space of three months, disputing and persuading the things concerning the kingdom of God. But when divers were hardened, and believe not, but speak evil of that way before the multitude. He departed from them and separated the disciples, disputing daily in the school of one Tyrannus. And this continued by the space of two years, so that all they which dwelt in Asia heard the word of the Lord Yahweh Shah, both Jews and Greeks. And Yahweh wrought special miracles by the hands of Paul. So that from his body were brought unto the sick handkerchiefs and aprons, and the diseases departed from them, and the evil spirits went out of them. Right? And here go the point. Then certain of the vagabond Jews, exorcists, took upon them to call over them which had evil spirits the name of the Lord Yahweh Shai, saying, We had we adjured you by Yahweh Shai, whom Paul preacheth. And there were seven sons of one Sceva, a Jew, and chief of the priest, which did so. And the evil spirit answered and said, Yahweh Shai I know, and Paul I know, but who are you? And the man in whom the evil spirit was leaped on them and overcame them, and prevailed against them so that they fled out of that house naked and wounded. So the thing was, you know, these guys, you know, they wanted to pretty much, you know, do their own thing. You know, whether it was for uh, vainglory or or what, you know, I don't, I'm not too sure. The scriptures doesn't go into it, you know, but certain people see this word. You know, and, and, you know, we, we, 
It's up to you how much you outside to, to, to determine whether you're uh, truly down for this, you know, for him or not. You know, the the scriptures uh, talks about how, um, you know, there were certain men who were speaking uh, in the name of Yahweh Shah and, uh, you know, the, the disciples came to uh, Yahweh Shah. You know, and he said, you know, uh, you know, let let them alone, you know, because, you know, ultimately, Yahweh Shai is being preached, you know. So it's a it's a good thing that you believe in this truth and that you want to teach this word. You know, you want to go out there. You want to, you know, do this work. But if there is a camp set up, you should want to g come up under the order of that camp, man, you know. Especially if you, you know, believe in this, this, this word, you want to follow, uh, like let's say great millstone, you know, you, you should get permission from the, uh, the, the, the camp hits to check and see if you want, you know, if, if you're able to do that, you know, if you're able to, to go out there and, uh, you know, push the work, you know, and, and the spirit, you know, if it, if the spirit allows, then, then. You know, you'll do that, but ultimately, you know, you you should want to make sure that the works that you are doing are righteous, man, and not evil. So you need to take in consideration of how you uh add onto this work, man. You know? Um with that said, I'm gonna get this uh scripture. Um it's uh first Corinthians uh three Okay, um, three and, uh, 11, um, three, three and 10, um, um, nine, I'm going to jump, jump down to nine. It's for, we are laborers together with Yahweh by Shemiah Oshah, right? And that's where we are, you know, the brothers in the camp. You know, we labor together, you know, it's hard to, to go out there and uh, read and, and speak on your own. You know, it's hard to do that, you know, and if you're not in the right spirit, then that evil spirit that's going, you know, that's out there because Satan uh, pretty much runs this uh, society, you know, and you are, you are able to get ran up off that corner if you're not doing this work in truth and sincerity, man, you know. Uh, or, or get confounded, you know, or just get taken out the truth all in all, man. It says, uh, you are God's, God's husband, husbandry and ye are God's buildings, building according to the grace of Yahweh, the most high, Yahweh, which is given unto me as a wise master builder. I have laid the foundation foundation. And another build it for their their own. But let every man take heed how he buildeth their thereupon. You know, so in this truth, you know, when it comes down to the great millstone, you know, from the apostles on down, you know, the apostles, you know, they so showing brothers how to, to, to be in order, you know, what what you're supposed to do, you know. Um they didn't get this far because they, uh, they did it on their own, man. Yeah, they they ultimately left HODC, and that you know we are a product, you know of you know the apostles going out there together and pushing this work. Okay, there was nobody else out there that was you know doing this work and saying that they was down with your help by some you you know that you know eventually uh, was still going on. At the time that the apostles was was pushing this uh, work, man, back then, you know, because if, if they were, then they would be here today, you know, or they would be in, in Great Millstone, you know. Now, you do have certain guys that, you know, was, you know, or claimed to be um, never, never put down the plow that was from back then, you know. But the thing is, we're talking about Great Millstone, you know. You, you can't. You can't just, uh, you know, if it's a store right here called uh, whatever restaurant or whatever, you know, like let's say it's um, um, uh, 
Chick-fil-A or something like that, you know? Like, you can't just go put on a, 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 a freaking Chick-fil-A uniform and just hop behind the counter and, and start taking orders, man, you know? Or just start up your own Chick-fil-A um, business, man, you know? So you have to take heed on to what, how you're building, man, and it's truth. It says, for, for other foundation can no man lay than that is laid, which is Yahweh Shah, right? Now, if any man built upon this foundation, gold, silver, precious stones, wood, hay, stubble, every, man, every man's work shall be made manifest, for the day shall declare it, because it shall be revealed by fire, and the fire shall try every man's work of what sort it is, you know? And, and you know, if you see the foundation, you know, certain certain cities got certain camps or whatever, you know, and that's the, the, the uh, foundation for that city, you know? You should want to come in under the foundation, you know, under the, the umbrella of that, uh, that camp, you know, as far as, you know, Great Millstone. But you got guys that... You know, say that they want to be a part of, you know, this truth. Like I said, you don't have to be in Great Millstone to to, to be of the elect. But if you want to go by the, the, the term Great Millstone or GMS, you should at least go through the pro proper protocol to, you know, make sure that you're doing things decently and in order. Um, I'm going to get that 1 Corinthians um, 14 and 40. Let all things be done decently and in order, you know? <laughs> we shouldn't have to, to look at a video, you know, and just randomly see, you know, somebody claiming to be great most on, you know, without even asking, you know, the the, the part, you know, the uh, camp leaders and, you know, and your, your camp, you know, or your area. Like, that just looks like it's just totally out of order, you know? Like, you know... For the most part, we okay with uh, with uh, guys pushing this work, you know, getting the name ultimately pushed out there, you know, teaching pe teaching people that they're Israel, you know. <clears throat> but if a, if a if a person came up, you know, are are you going to be rebellious, you know, to to the, to the uh, to the to the heads that are already there in that 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 uh, that uh, that uh, state that you're in? You know, the city that you're in, are you going, you know, if somebody comes up and asks you a question like, well, um, how do you feel about the, 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 the other guys? You know, what are you going to say, man? You know, oh, those guys are great millstone, but they, the Lord is dealing with me. Like, you know, that's, that's out of order, man. And you setting it up, you know, you don't understand that that is a, is a evil deed if you're not doing it in righteousness, man. You know? Um, this is, uh, Hebrews 13 and, um, 17, obey them that have rule over you. You know, I guess this is one of the reasons why guys can't come in and, and do, you know, be in order because they can't, you know, take orders. It says, and submit yourselves for day watch, uh, for day watch for your souls is they that must give account that they may do it with joy and not with grief for that is unprofitable to for you you know we you know we ultimately want want you know brothers to make it if you are the elect you know we want we want we don't ex want brothers to 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 if you found out that you were you were Israelite you know you claim to be in great millstone you know and and we know that everybody in in, in great millstone ain't right so you know, ultimately, at the end of the day, you guys that want to do your own thing, you're doing us a favor, you know? If you don't want to go through the proper protocol, you know, just doing this for, for um, men's sake, you know? Um, but the, the, the thing is, you have certain camps, you know, that have camp, well, every camp has a camp leader, camp heads or whatever, and those uh, camp heads are supposed to help you along the way as far as growing in this work man in this truth man you know this is not no um this is not a situation where uh where brothers are um <clears throat> you know 
you know, uh, getting on, uh, get, well, brothers aren't supposed to be getting on you for, for no reason, man. You know, this is, uh, Romans 13 and, uh, one Let every soul be subject unto the higher powers, right? For there is no power, but of Yahweh by some Yahweh Sha. You know, it's talking, you know, going into the camp heads. It says the powers that be are ordained of Yahweh by some Yahweh Sha. So if, if, if there's a great millstone camp in the city that you're in, and that's a camp head, no matter if you feel as though that that person is wicked or whatever the case may be, you know, you come in under the order of that, that, that camp, man, you know, and you endure that hardness as a soldier because if you, if you're right and your heart and your mind, well, your heart is your mind. If your mindset, your spirit is, is towards you out by some y'all side and that camp leader isn't, you know, from all fair experience, I've seen it. The, that the camp the camp head got kicked out man you know and it's about being patient suffering you know it says uh whosoever therefore resisteth the power resisteth the the ordinance of of god okay you resisting the 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 fact that the lord set up a camp you know in the city that you're in you know you don't want to come up under the order you resisting the order that the lord set up 